What's up everyone, welcome back. As we have a very dull knife, a booster box of Sword and Shield, Fuse and Strike, the newest Pokemon set to drop, with more evolutions, more code cards, some psychic types, and all sorts of other goodness. Let's see what we get today. We're going right into it. Ah! Pokemon packs are much harder to open than magic packs, so. Oh, well. That, the code cards are upside down. They're upside down. A bot may have got that one. I'm sorry if it, if it did. We're going to go through these a little slow. We got a Snorlax, a Snom, a Dreepy, I love Dreepy, Makuhita, Rookity, a Breloom Reverse, which is an uncommon, a Blissey Rare, a Fire Energy, a Schoolboy, a Primeape, and a Zarud. So a very tame way to start off the opening, but maybe we can ramp up to something great. So now I have to do this, I think. Code card. I got a Toto Dial. Oops. A Phantom. A Snorlax, a Snom, a Dreepy, very similar to the last pack. Uh, a Lace of Sparkle, and hey, our first Hollow Rare, a Butterfree. Man, that's a shiny Butterfree. And an Energy card with a Croconaw, an Excadrill, and a Dubwool. Not to be, not to be confused with Dubstep. I wonder if Dubwool's are into dub stuff though. Maybe. Any dub wool aficionados out there? Please feel free to let me know. Code card. And we got a shroomish, a klefki, a trubbish, a totodile, a fan. So this is the second time I've seen totodile followed up by a phantom. We got a Skitty. It's so pretty. It's like a kitty. And our rare is hey, a Rillaboom V. Nice. First V card that we pulled out of the set. Hopefully many more to come. If it's anything like Evolving Skies, there will be about four V cards, maybe three special cards like Full Arts, Alt Arts, Secret Rare, Hyper Rares. We'll just have to see what we pull. And this new, I don't know if it's a new way of putting code cards in or if this is just like a little different. We have an Onyx, that's the first time I've seen that. A Choodle, also the first time I've seen that. A Shroomish, a Klefki, we have seen these cards already. A Trubbish, a Grimmsnarl, that's a Reverse Rare. And a Verizion. We got a Water Energy, Diggersby, Sydney, and a Cross Switcher. This pack will open up very nicely. The Volibee wants to be seen. So we will show it off. And right behind it is a Dewpider. And a Meow, some new Pokemon that we have not seen yet. An Onyx. A Choodle. Onyx, yeah. Onyx and Choodle. We have a Victini, which, you know, you get a mythical Pokemon at Uncommon. Just the way it goes, I guess, sometimes. And a Eveltal, rare, not even hollow. Man, how the mighty have fallen. We got a Kaparaja, a Zoroark, and a Simipor. And we got a lot of new stuff that's happening. We got new Pokemon. We got new magic. I'm recording a bunch of stuff at the same time and giving away code cards. Giving away Pokemon code cards. Giving away MTG Arena promo codes. Um, that video may have already went up. We got a Toodle and a Volibee, a Dewpider. Volibee and Dewpider, that's also been a... It, there's a lot of... There's a lot of, like... Like, uh, setting here. We got a Latios Reverse Rare. Pretty cool. And... Alright! A Chandelure V Full Art. And that is a sweet looking Full Art. Yeah, that is very nice. 
Very nice indeed. Gotta love that chandelier. We got a dancer, a pengoro, and a grapple locked. Yeah, but we got lots of new things going on. You know, this is the season for new card sets. New stuff, new code cards. We have some MTG Arena code cards that went out for the Crimson Val pre-release. I am giving away code cards right here. Uh, once this video probably hits two li or two views, it'll probably all be over. We got a Land Dress Reverse. That is a rare. And a Gorbis with an Electric Energy, a Pukumuku, a Schoolgirl, and a Chili, Cillian, and Cress. Or Chili and C Silen. Okay. Chili and Silen and Cress. Not Chili and Silen. Got Pan Sage, which is for Silen. I think Pan Sage is with Silen. I don't know. Anyways. We got a Qfant and a Gligar. A Slugma. A Skitty. I think we have a V card. We have a Pan Seer reverse and our rare, which is stuck to our reverse, is a ugh, a Cinderace V. Nice. Cool looking Cinderace. With a fighting energy, a Victini, an electric, and a Dunsparce. So off to a pretty good start. You know, we got a couple of these. We got the Chandelure V. Pretty nice looking. I wonder if we can pull one of them Alt Art Evolutions. I don't even know what the most sought after card in this set is. Maybe it is an Evolution. And I forget which ones are in this particular set. I forgot which ones were in Involving Skies, so I mean, all things can, all things fair. We got a Swampert Hollow Rare, and that's a cool looking Swampert. You know, you don't really see Swampert swimming. You normally see Swampert in some kind of marsh, like muddy, hey, Turtonator, muddy kind of ground setting. So it's nice to see Swampert swimming for a change. Because, you know, Swampert is a water type that knows ground moves. Not a ground type that knows water moves. I think I saw some shine. I think I saw some shine, but it could just be the reverse. We got a Toxel. A Totodile, a Cardavana, a Clam Peril, a Snome, and yes, it was just the reverse. A Scent Scorch, an Electric Energy, Phalanx, Semi Sage, and a Dancer. Kind of just breezing through the Pokemon box. The Magic boxes took a little bit longer. And at some point, I may just and go through the comments, but this Pokemon. I think I saw some shine. Maybe, maybe I'm getting myself, maybe I'm psyching myself out again. Who knows, who knows? We got a Mantine and something, a Grubbin, some some new comments we haven't seen, a Rotom, a Smeargle, a bunch of comments we haven't seen yet. Carvana, an Obstagoon Rare Reverse, Nice. And, oh, here we go. I knew I saw that shine. I knew I saw that shine. We have a Hyper Rare Sydney. Look at that. Look at that Mohawk. Look at that Mohawk. Hyper Rare Sydney making an appearance. And look, hey, 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 we have a regular Sydney. A regular Sydney to go with our Hyper Rare Sydney. It's probably not very focused, but think we got there towards the end. Whoa, whoa, whoa. These are new. I have not, well, hold on. So that's, so it looks like we do have green and white code cards. Or no, we have code cards with different borders. This has a black border. This has a black border and this has a white border. I wonder if that course. Oh, sorry. I just kind of ruined it for someone. Maybe. Maybe a bot got that. Let's see. So, oh, so we have a different code card set up, eh? Not Canadian, but let's see what's in this pack. We've got a Skarmory, a Jinx, a Mantine, 
Oop. A grubbin. Kind of all over the place. A stuffle of Vulpix. So cute. So cute. And a. It's a V. A Gengar V. So maybe black border code cards are V or hollows are better, and white border are uh, just rares. Let's see how that works out. New code cards. Wasn't even paying attention. All right, let's see what we got. So it's a white border, so I'm guessing white border code cards are gonna be rare. And black border code cards are going to be uh, V or hollows are better. Got a Panpour, a Sawaddle, a Skarmory, a Jinx, a Darumaka, a Toxicroak. Okay, so for the two packs that we've observed so far, that seems to be the case. We got a Low Punny, a Marsh Stomp, and a Crossiever. Cross Seaver. This pack, white bordered, so regular rare, should be. Got a Star You, a Mawile, first time you see some of these as well. Aquahita, Pampor, Sawaddle, a Sligu, nice, kind of watercolor Sligu, a Granbull, regular rare, so still fitting the mold. We got a Schoolgirl. A Luxio and a Metapod. Almost through with the first half of the box. Oops, let's do it this way. We got the code card. White border, so regular rare. I'm probably going to stop checking after this first half of the box. Anyway, but we got a Q fence, a Levani, a Water Energy, a Lace of Sparkle, Beware, and Skaters Park. Three packs left to go in the first half of the box. This is a black bordered cord card, so. Hollow or better is what the uh, is what the guess is. Hollow or better. And if anyone's opened up some of this already, uh, feel free to let me know. We've got a Vulpix, a Meltan, a Toxel, a Graveler, and there we go. It's a Hollow Toxtricity. So I'm guessing that's the way it goes for code cards now. We got a Farewell Bell, a Galarian Lanoon, and a Stantler. Uh, I need to. Clean up some stuff real quick. Cause it's kind of getting messy over here. Didn't do a good job of dealing with the trash. But uh, I mean, the first half of the box has reaped some uh, pretty nice rewards so far. Uh, three V's, a hyper rare, and a full art. That's pretty good for a half a box. We got a Stuffle, a Sandy Gast, a Plusle, a Snubble, which Snubble is a common, a Corbis, and a Electric Energy Delcaddy Darkrai, also fall into uncommon, and Croconaw. And our last pack of the first half. Before we go into halftime. Code card. And we have a Makuhita, a Rookity, a Darumaka, a Sizzlepeed, a Stuffle, a Panpour, a Golem, it's a cool looking Golem, with a Fighting Energy, Spongy Gloves, Frost Moth, and Simi. Ooh, wow. Like colored pencil Simister. So let me just. Stretch the back for a second and move into the second half. We are back from halftime, very short halftime. 
halftime report is three V cards, one full art chandelier, one full art chandelier, and one hyper rare Sydney. So let's see what we'll pull out of the second half. Are we gonna start off hot or are we gonna have to build up to the madness? Got a code card. And we have the Snubble, the Geodude, the Sizzlepeed, the Clef Key, the Pan Sage, a Claydol Reverse, which is a rare, and an Electrode, because it's gonna go BOOM! A Grapple Locked, and a Diggers B with a Sydney. Moving right along, because we want to get those uh, shinies, those shiny shinies. We have our code card. We have a Darumaka and an Ndidi. First time we've seen Ndidi and the first time we've seen Growlithe. Phalanx, a Morpeko, that's the first time we've seen that. We got a Dunsparce and an Orekorio with a Grass Energy, a Swadloon, a Kremomatic, and a Skaters Park. We got some cards on packs we have not seen yet as well. We have Genesect and Mew yet to make an appearance. May not make an appearance today, but maybe they will. Maybe we'll get a chance to see the mythical Pokemons. We got a Krogunk, a Pansier, a Gumi, an Erokuda, a Phantop Reverse, a Kangaskhan Rare, Kangaskhan, like, showing off its Martial Arts, Dunsparce, Dancer, and Pangoro. So first few packs, nothing really to write home about, but doesn't mean that it's all for naught just yet. Got the code card. I haven't been even checking to see if I've been putting the code cards right side up. I'm just hoping that I have been. Sometimes it's hard to really see what's going on on the tiny camera screen. Makes things look tiny. We got a Star U and a Butterfree Hollow Rare. Not bad. Nice looking Hollow Rare. Got the Excadrill and the Trevenant and a Sandslush. Some new and common to the party. We got the code card. We got a Drillbur and a Shinx and a Baneri. And a Basculin. A Grubbin, a Rare Reverse Gorbis, and a Vicavolt. Move the Fire Energy into the energy pile. We've got Shauna, Victini, and Electric. We have not seen Shauna yet, but we have seen Electric and Victini. Mythical Pokemon in the Uncommon slot. Which, that, I mean, it may have been a case already. I just, I don't know, just, it is striking to me at this very moment. Maybe because I'm thinking about how hard it was to get some of these Pokemon in. But it's not even hard to get on Pokemon Go. You just have to work for them a little bit. So I guess it does kind of make them uncommon level. The rare level Pokemon would be the ones that you have to pull out in five-star raids. Which is a pain. Especially if you don't have friends. Not that I don't have friends. Uh, we got a, a Pancham. And a, a Lafini. I have friends. I have, I have plenty of friends. Maybe just not a lot of friends to pay Pokemon Go. Uh, but this isn't a YouTube channel about my friends. It's a YouTube channel with me opening up packs of TCG goodness. Like Magic the Gathering and Pokemon. So we're going to stick to that with this Clobopus, a Tynamo, a Zorua, a Shelder, a Caterpie, a Reverse Schoolboy, and a Cloyster with a Metal Energy. And this half of the box has not been impressive so far. You know, we got off to a good start on the first half of the box, but uh, we seem to have hit a dry spell. Maybe if I complain enough, Schrodinger will bless me with some kind of alternate art or hyper rare or secret rare because the last box we opened which was evolving size that box was pretty insane all things considered you had a hyper rare a secret rare 
and an alternate R. We have a Deoxys, which is a rare reverse, and a... All right, well, ask and you shall receive a Mew VMAX. Look at that mythical Pokemon. Oh, and it is very shiny. Mew VMAX joining the party. Very happy to have you along, Mew. So I'm thinking we may have two more hits, one more V-card and one more Full Art VMAX or better. I think, that's, that's, that's gonna be my guess. Here's the code card though. All right, we have a Sigilyph, a Toxel, a Totodile, a Baneary, a Charger Bug, and <laughs> Hey! Hey! Welcome to the party! Secret Fire Energy! Whew! Man! That's that's pretty gorgeous. Pretty gorgeous. Uh, I, I don't think we're getting any more major hits after this. Uh, but hey, may maybe I can complain, but that Secret Fire Energy, that's looking pretty hot. No pun intended. Or was it? Maybe I'm just a very punny guy. But if I was a punny guy, I would have waste many more videos and more puns. And I don't know where I have this burst of energy from. But uh, maybe it's because I'm giving away these wonderful code cards and we're pulling just great stuff out of out of the set. I mean, I, I think it's great. Let's be fair. I, I don't really know if it's great or not. I just think it's great. But we have a reverse Lanoon. Galarian Lanoon. It's stuck to something. All right, reverse Lanoon, and a Latios, Latios, with a Metal Energy, a Dreadnought, a Sligu, and a Shauna. I think we got eight packs left, seven or eight. It didn't really count that well. Code card. All right, we got a Shelmet, a Drillbur, a Bunnelby, and underneath the bottle me is a, a mudkip, which I guess I should show because I know people love mudkips. Do you like mudkips? I like mudkip. Our reverse is a Barascuda. And our rare is a Latios. So we pulled Latios and Latios back to back. And we got a Stantler, a Glissor, and a Scorch. So I wonder what the release of Pokemon Arceus Legends coming up. If we're gonna get some uh, new Pokemon TCGI, like I can't imagine that we wouldn't. I mean, it is an opportunity to sell more Pokemon, and why would Pokemon and whoever makes the TCG, which is who makes the TCG? Uh, I guess Pokemon, the Pokemon company. I guess uh, why would they squandered their opportunity to make more money? Pansage, a Qfent, a Gligar, a Plusle, ooh, an Arcanine, a Darkest Energy, a Perserker, a Fusion Strike Energy, and a Alyssa Spark. Sparkle. Six packs left to go. towards the end but I hope everyone's enjoyed the video so far we have pulled some pretty amazing stuff I can't complain like it's always good when you get four hits that are full arts or better I guess like full art V max hyper rare secret rare we got a ha ha lucha and a ooh nice a holographic for alligator lots of water Pokemon too because we got swampert and for alligator Got a semi seer, a farewell bell, and a lanoon. Again, down towards the end. Got the code card. And isn't this like the cutest bunnelby that you've ever laid your eyes on? It's so happy. It's so happy. It's like it's like me right now. Like it's like kind of happy and cheery. And, Running through the moonlight, except I'm not running through the moonlight. We got an Eevee. We have a Clef Key. 
And we have a Golem with an Electric Energy, Dunsparce, Kremomatic, Eldegoss. So we have four packs left, getting down to the very end of this Pokemon opening. And I hope you all have enjoyed the opening so far. And I hope you all are also having just a wonderful night, wonderful day. Uh, depending on when this goes up, wonderful week and wonderful week. Just hope you're having a wonderful life. We got a Slugma and a Gudra. Get an energy and some uncommons. I'm just going to put those to the side. Three packs left. One twelfth of the box. Just tearing it open, getting the code card for y'all. And we got the Pampor, the Eevee, the Shinx, the Shelmet, the Drillbur, the Jinx Reverse, a Maractus. A fire energy, some uncommons, including a quick ball, which I think that's the first quick ball we've seen. We are down to the penultimate pack. You know, this was really all about the middle. The beginning didn't start off great. The ending, after the secret energy, the secret rare wasn't particularly good. It was all about the middle of this particular set of cards. We got an Indeedee, a Growlithe, a Garbodor, Reverse Hollow, a Landris, Hollow Foil. So I think that will finish off any of the hits we'll get in the box. I'd be surprised if we got anything else, but I've been surprised before. So did we get the last pack magic? Let's crack it open and find out. We have a code card for all the wonderful viewers. Well, one wonderful viewer because they're going to be the person that gets it first. And I'm sorry that's the way code cards work. We got a Smeargle. We got a Quillfish. We got a Tynamo. We got a Galarian Meowth. We got a Glossiflor. We have a Sawaddle. And our last card is a Greedent V. So at least we got a V card with a Nom 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 Incisors as an attack. But hey, pretty good. It's about what I predicted. Four V card hits and four above V card hits, which you can see here. We got our four Vs, our Chandelure, Sydney, Mew V Max, and Energy card. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. If you enjoyed it, just give it a like, thumbs up, do all that kind of stuff if you want. But until next time, I just like for you all to stay safe and take care out there it is a it is still a crazy world and we are living through it the best we can crack some packs and until next time goodbye